Skadoosh, skadoosh. Welcome back to the channel, my ninjas. Joey Moss with Bad Boy Gaming. How are you today? No, seriously, how are you doing? Like, you have to actually respond in the comments. That'd be cool. We got Ixalan. We got an Ixalan booster box. Now, despite what some YouTubers are saying about this product, it is not selling for over $100 or $110. It's, it's not even selling for $90. You can pick these up on eBay right now for $84.99 free shipping. And if you do decide to go that route, by all means, check out the description in every video and go through Ebates. You get 10 bucks uh, for your first purchase and you're supporting the channel as, at the same time and you get like between two and 10% off any purchase on Ebates at any given time. So make sure you check that out. All right, Ixalan, let's do this. Also, while we're getting these packs out, quick shout outs to Cody DeBell, Dan Rayner, Jerry Ogren, Jacob Narr, Andrew Campos, Daz Berserker, Marcus Wood, Juan Santos, Jake Mike Malky. I'm sorry, Jake. Uh, Jake Michael My Malk. Sorry, bro. Spencer McLaughlin, Travis Gregory Jr., the channel MJ Chronicles. Shout out to MJ Chronicles. He does uh, openings as well. Uh, for Magic the Gathering and also to some other streams. Make sure you check him out. That's MJ Space Chronicles. Uh, also, Andrew Pilgrim, Matthew Waters, Philip Hamilton, uh, Michael Brennan. Whoop, let's see what we got here. Boosh, 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 boosh. Conqueror's Galleon. Nope, not looking for you. Uh, Carolyn Harper, Trenton Vigil, Yuri DeVry, Doug Schaefer, Joshua Hornback, Pete George, Josh Onik. JD Anglin and Frank Airy. You guys are the shiznit. Shiznit. Fun word, huh? Fun word. All right, let's do this. What are we going to get? Uh, Teladonali's skin, uh, skin Shifter. That artwork's sweet, though. I can dig it. I can, I, can, I can dig it. I do think these are quite undervalued. $84.99 for a box right now is relatively cheap. Um, but yeah, there was a few people talking that these are going for over 100. They are just simply not. Maybe that was clickbait material. Who knows? River Sneak, cool card. With a foil call to the feast. Love that card. Use it in a deck. It has won many matches, I must say. And a treasure map to punt. That's what I'm talking about. Treasure map's legit. Um, yeah, it's just a legit card. You can find it in a lot of decks now. So bada bing. So bada bing. That's what it is. Bada bing. And if anyone's wondering about the shout-outs, why that happens, uh, those are patrons. Uh, and depending on the tier, you get a shout-out. It's pretty much that simple. Link in the description in every video. Walk the Plank, Glorifier of Dusk. Oh, man, that's all we got was Avraska's Contempt. I've had it with this horse shit. All right. You can't, you can't do good every time, you know. You can try, but uh, it just wasn't a good enough pool. I mean, really, a bulk rare? Frasca's Contempt? Unbelievable, man. I just, I can't. I can't. Duskborn Sky Marcher. Deep Root Waters. Thundering Spineback. BAM! A search for a Skanta! Oh my god. And in front was a Frasca's Contempt. Come on, man. Get off me. Get off me. That is nasty. Wow. Back to back stupid pools. Uh, this is making up for the Dominaria booster box we opened yesterday or two days ago. I don't know who saw that one, but that was a dumpster fire, you know. That was like a turd that wouldn't flush down the toilet, right? Just terrible, man. Just terrible. But this box already, between those two cards alone, I almost purchased the entire box or paid for the entire box. Crazy. Dragon Skull Summit. We are on fire right now. Oh my gosh. That stuff that burns, you know. Wow. Scorcha, scorcha. Scorching. Um, yeah, we'll put that land in that pile. Someone will be triggered by that. Holy smokes, what a what a good box so far. Punch that like button by all means, and if you're not subscribed, something's wrong with you. Uh, we got Wanted Scoundrels, all up in the piece. Raging Swordtooth, Raptor Hatchling, and a Dream Caller Siren. No Mythics yet. I forget what the good Mythics in this set are. Just kidding. We got a Carnage Tyrant we're hoping to pull. That'd be sweet. That would top this box off like crazy. We could, we could stop right there if I pull a Carnage Tyrant. We could just stop there. Siren Storm Tamer, amazing uncommon. It sure is. River Sneak, Raging Raptors, and a Fell Flagship. You know, the vehicle decks, they never really took off too much. I mean, they're okay. They're all right, but nothing, nothing to get the panties in a bundle over, you know? Just nothing crazy there. We got a Vicious Conquistador, 
a belligerent Brontodon Seeker Squire, and a Sunbird's Invocation. All right, all right. I don't think I've ever seen Sunbird's Invocation used in any deck. Whenever you cast a spell from your hand, reveal a top X card your library or X that spells converted mana cost. You may cast a card revealed this way with converted mana cost X or last without paying its mana cost. Wow. Put the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. Well, maybe you could make a deck around that. Probably wouldn't work too well, I'm assuming, but you never really know. Grim Captain's Call, Merfolk Branchwalker. And our first bulk mythic is going to Awakening Sun's Avatar. <clears throat> the old Awakening Sun's Avatar. Oh, yeah, there's some solid uh, Planeswalkers in this set as well. I think for for 84 bucks, I mean, I paid about 80 for it with Ebates and all that. This is ridiculous. I mean, even Unclaimed Territory is worth a little something there, you know? Unreal. Vanquisher's Banner, another good card. Just so many, there's so many good pulls in this set. It's really undervalued, honestly. Um, not a, for, okay, this should be going for, honestly, it should be selling for 95 bucks a box. But why it's selling for only like 70, or not 70, like 84 is beyond me. Great, great card. Uh, great cards in this set. Ruin Raider, all up in it. How's my focus? Are we focused? We are so focused right now. Yeah, ridiculousness. Ridiculousness. Uh, tonight, I'm going to be dropping another video. The number one deck in standard from the weekend. We will be playing that, giving a little test run for it. Glacial Fortress, solidness. With a merfolk out the back door. Giggity, giggity. Skadoosh. Frenzied Raptor in this beginning. Dive down. Favorable wins with a Rowdy Crew Mythic. Oh, are we going to get burned on Mythics because they put a Skanta in here and uh, Vraska's Contempt? I think we're going to get burned on Mythics. Oh, man, I haven't felt the burn like that since I was 18. Giggity. Uh, we got a Kite Sail Freebooter. Why did I always think that card was a, was a rare? Huh, it's craziness. Kinjali's Sunwing. I haven't had a foil in a few packs here. So we're going to need to step that up. We need, a, we need a nice foil slot here. Nice foil slot. Slice and Twain. Call to the Feast. Tempest Caller. And Captain Lannery Storm. That's something right there. You can take that. You know. Halloween's a day away. I'm, I'm dressing up as myself. I don't know about you guys, but that's what I'm doing. I figure it's the way to go. Feel the Ruin. Even that's like a $5 card right now. That's like the most expensive card in standard right now. Ridiculousness. Ridiculousness, kids. Ridiculousness. Captivating Crew. That has fluctuated in price. A Foil Dusk Legion Dreadnought. Got to admire the artwork on that, I must say. That is something to look at. Can we get a Planeswalker? Let's just pull that guy. I'll, I'll settle for that guy. We don't need a Vraska or anything. Is Vraska even in this set? Probably. We got an entrancing melody. Cool, man. So in trance. I'm caught in a trap. I can't walk out. Because I love you too much, baby. Aw. Death Gorge Scavenger. And a foil thrash of raptors. Not bad. You guys remember trap cards? Remember trap music? Damn. Traps are fun, huh? Uh, Tishani's Raiders Wake with Dusk Legion. Shapers of Nature. Waker of the Wilds. How about that, huh? That's, that's cool. You're into that sort of thing. Come on, picking it up. Here we go. We're going to get something stupid right now, guys. Wild Growth Walker. Seeing a lot of play. Sorceress Spyglass. Not too shabby. Not too shabby of a pull right there. Not too shabby at all. Yes. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. What's it going to be? It's got to be gotten right now. It's going to be gotten. Watch this. We're going to got it. Bishop of Rebirth. We did not get that. We No. We got to put that down. Vraska, where are you hiding, you little, little skis? Where are you at? We're going to have to find you up in here. You know, come over, stay the night, you know, pack a bag. It's all good. Rigging Runner, Verdant Rebirth, Emissary of Sunrise, Spell Swindle. That's right. I, I don't know why. That artwork's cool on the foil. I just, I, I get depressed when I see that. I don't know. Is it just me? I don't know. Is there a least favorite card you guys don't like playing against in this set? There's a few for me. Ashes of the Abhorrent. With a foil swamp, well, that is something. 
So our foils had not been all that good. We haven't pulled a rare, uh, a good rare foil out of this yet. Maybe we will today. Maybe we will today. Case hit, anyone? Can we get a case hit? Lightning Strike Solid. Primal Amulet. That's not bad. I like these flip lands, the enchantment artifact flip land things, whatever you want to call them. Uh, they're pretty They're pretty neat when they transform. Transform lands? What do they call them? Transform cards? I don't know. Transformers? 1980s? Anybody? Sky Terror? Try to course? Settle the Wreckage. Man, garbage again. Another good hit. Skadoosh. That is nasty. I skadoosh every time I get a good hit. Not every time. But most of the time. I used to do up something else on camera instead of skadooshing when I got a good when I got a good pool. Did you know that? You gotta go way back and look at my content when I was a wee lad. Very inappropriate stuff back then. Priest of the Awakening Sun with a foil Queen's Bay Soldier. Pretty legit. Pretty legit. Alright, we are down to about eight packs. And I think we did phenomenal with this box so far. This box has been pretty good to us. It really has. Deep Root Champion. Deeply Rooted. He's so deep rooted, he's a champion. All up in them roots. He's just beating the heck out of stumps and trees. That's what he's doing. He's just, yeah, he is doing that. He's doing that. You know, I was driving around the ghetto not long ago. And uh, Ixon's buying these cool cards. Growing right to Itlamach. I love you, man. Such a great card. I had more hope for you. Someone put this in an elf deck and make it work. Crikey, mate. Uh, but I was driving around the ghetto one day. And uh, it's actually in a video. You can go back and see it. When I was hunting for uh, some cheap packs, uh, those dollar store packs. And while I'm driving, you can clearly see this guy taking a baseball bat, standing with three, three of his other friends. And they are just beating the oh, thematic compass foil. Nice. Not one of the most desirable ones, but still, that's pretty nasty. That is pretty nasty indeed. Look at the artwork on that. The backside just flipped that around. But he was just busting a friggin' tree with a baseball bat. Middle of the day. Like, what are you trying to do, man? You're not going to be able to tear that tree down with your baseball bat. No, I didn't understand it. It's in a video buried somewhere. I'm sure you guys can find it. We have fun. We have fun. Hostage taker. Another solid hit. Skadoosh. So we pulled two mythics. Is that right? Two mythics. So we've probably got at least one more hiding. Where's that other one? What's it going to be? What's this last one going to be? Savage Stomp. Rampaging Ferrasaban. That's not cool. Pull the old ban card. I remember when that card came out, I said it was going to be one of the most impactful cards in the format. I'm like, it's just such a good card, and then it gets banned. Terrible. There's too many um, cards that... Um, and this would be sideboard every time. If you're, if you're playing up against... What the hell, man? Holy ball twister. We got another Vraska's Contempt. You got to be pooping on me. Man, that is nasty. That, really, what I just said is nasty. Um, Vraska's Contempt. Holy smokes, man. This is just on fire. And we still got a Mythic hiding. If we don't, I'll be upset. Two Vraska's Contempts and one? I don't know what I was talking about earlier. Wow. Smash the like button if you enjoy the video. This means a lot. Vana Butcher of Megan. All right, so that was our... Uh, that's not bad. You know, it's a little something. A lot of value in here. But I definitely got my value back tenfold on this. Pretty nifty. You can fold a piece of paper ten times. Congratulations. Ruthless Nav. Sure. Thundering. Bam. Spell Pierce Foil. That's gorgeous to look at. With an Argyle's Bloodfast. Really cool card right there. Really cool. Really cool indeed. We had a great box here. The Mythic slot was not that impressive, but you know what? <laughs> the Rare slot was entirely impressive. Uh, we're all going home winners today. Yeah. And a Shadowed Caravel. Nice. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you skadoosh all over it. As always, PLA.